this is Aspen. I usually don't do reviews and I just do close ups so you can see what you're getting in the real life. But um, there were some people complaining about the gaps on this, which is the gap right here at the knee, which you can see I don't have a problem with. I don't know why other people are getting ones that don't fit correctly. Now there was a gap all the way around until I played with it and then I finally got it to sit all the way down. The peg needed to be wiggled into place. Take some finesse and patience. Then the same thing with the arm. I have no gap in the arm. And this is the exclusive arm and the regular arm is the same way as well. No gap. It looks perfectly fine. The hair, it's uh, made to look like it's dry on top and then the bottom is wet so the bottom is a little more glossy which is a nice touch. The coral all looks good. All the lines are painted well. And uh, another thing people were worried about was the purple used for shading which you cannot tell it's purple. I mean in person you can see it, it's very faint but it might be picking up a little easier on the camera but it, it's not bad at all. The only purple you really notice is her eyeshadow. But the portrait looks good on this thing. The eyes look good, no googly eyes. The belt is nice, you can move the belt to where you want it. All the little straps on her, not all of them, but some of them, like these in the front, they actually move. They're like a PVC type material. Not sure exactly what they are. But yeah, mine mine came in pretty mint. No issues at all. No flaws that I can see. I was pleasantly surprised after seeing some other videos of her. But if you're on the fence, give her a chance. I think they did a good job with this one. 